If you hurl, you clean it up. Oh, that is a little spicy. Man, turn it up. Oh, you dropped a piece right here. <laughs> hey everybody, in today's video we are reacting to a channel called Beard Meets Food. Jeff first recommended this guy to me. And I was just thinking about how weird is it that people watch him eat for a living. And then I thought about, I wonder how many people have watched him eat. 1.2 billion people have watched this guy eat. Imagine, that's probably like a fifth of the world or something. Imagine if everybody was watching him eat at the same time how awkward that would be. Also, he just broke 4 million subscribers, so congrats on that. The video we reacted to today is called, This Barbecue Sandwich Challenge in Southern Carolina has been failed 76 times. Come on, America. You can't let the UK beat us. All right, let's check it out. It's cold in England out here. Hey. That's a nice little cut. Yeah, you guessed it. We're back in the good old United States of America. More specifically, South Carolina today. And we're at a place called Max Speed Shop. But they sell food, not speed. Just to <laughs> bash at this, the Fat Boy Challenge. Can you say fat? Enormous five pound sandwich, $77. Piled high with pork, brisket, burger, applewood, smoked bacon, queso blanco, slaw, ooh, fried pickles, and max burnout sauce. I'd have to change the slaw for something else, like double pickles or something. All right, let's check it out. These days? Probably not right. I've said it now. God. Ooh. I came to do your uh, fat boy challenge. Is that okay? It's, it's, yeah. That sounds, sounds weird, but I like, I just feel myself eating stuff. I gotta go grab a pin, but I do need you to sign a waiver. Okay, so. is that in case I die or choke to death or something like that? Yeah, yeah I get it. I get it. <laughs> It says preview on the paper. This is a cool waiver. Pretty standard for the most part. No help or sharing, no bathroom breaks. No dipping, that's a good one. Nobody wants to dip the bun in a drink. You must not hurl <laughs> for five minutes after your last bite. <laughs> if you hurl, you clean it up. Can't argue with that, can you? So the bucket, if you are to throw up, I need you to throw up in the bucket because if you don't throw up in the bucket, you have to clean it up. I promise. She doesn't know who she's talking to, does she? Yeah, so... I'll, I'll get it in the bucket. Try, try if that, if that happens. I hope yeah. it doesn't happen, but if it does happen... Yeah. I get it. <laughs> I can see it. Do you even uh, know who you're talking to, lady? Yeah, I signed the waiver. Yeah, I did sign the waiver. This down. I'm going to go get my stopwatch. You can finish this, right? Uh, <laughs> you can finish that first, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I'll be as quick as I can. You're good, man. All right, I'm at a place called Max Speed Shop today, which is in Greenville, South Carolina. And I'm taking on the Fat Boy Challenge. How much does it cost? Six five. But if you can finish it inside one hour. Bro, are you sitting like a girl? Fat Boy Challenge. How much does it cost? Six five. Say no more. But if you can finish it inside one hour, it's free. It's free, you get a shirt, and then you get a plaque on the wall. Just you do get a shirt. Yep. I Oh, everybody loves a shirt. I love a winner's t-shirt. In yeah. that case, I think, I think I'm ready. I think. So we we'll start the timer in a second here. You'll have one hour to finish. After you finish, you have to hold everything down for five minutes, and then you're done. Yeah, whenever you're ready, I'm, I'm good to go. Go ahead. All right. So your end time will be... This guy over here is like, are you serious? <laughs> Got it. Thank you. Got a second plate here. Right. You see that guy in the back there? Yeah. That's the best part about filming in America. People are always interested. Anyway, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode. We're at Max Speed Shop in Greenville today. Hey, this is actually really smart. He took the top bun off. He's going to eat down. I mean, it's pretty smart. I thought there was two onion rings on it in that picture or something. Doing battle with the not very sensitively named Fat Boy Challenge. Oh, that is a little spicy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I did not know that. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, burn out the spices one Yep. <laughs> uh, yeah, should have paid more attention to the menu. Thankfully, they don't cake it on, so it's unpleasant, but it doesn't cover the whole sandwich, which is good. And in case you're wondering, this thing contains burger patties, pulled pork, brisket, smoked bacon, cheese, slaw, pickles, and is accompanied by 
a half pound of mac and cheese. You get one out of finish. If you can do that, it's free. And you get a t-shirt too. The brisket's good. Just a bit of a shame about the hot sauce. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. This couple were great, by the way. Very supportive. I love that when I asked her if she could finish at the beginning, she said, do you mind if I finish my food first? <laughs> what are we doing now? Uh, oh yeah, we're just wiping the beard down. I'm trying to eat as clean as possible this year. One of my uh, few New Year's resolutions. I was actually gonna comment about how clean his beard was already. He dropped like one little piece on there. Oh, it tastes delicious. Apart from the hot sauce. Sauce, which is not hot. This should help. At least I hope it's not hot. Yeah, no, this should have taken a sample first. This was like a kind of a sweet and smoky barbecue sauce, thankfully. Should send the meat down a bit easier though. I love barbecue sauce. It should not fuse off of bread. I think I'm gonna try do the rest as a sandwich. Yeah. Yeah, no, nice strategy. See what you're doing there. It'll save you joy in the long run, and we'll need it. The bread is thick. Just eating that bun itself would be tough. That thing is gigantic. I'm fine. Thanks for Thank you, Mark. <laughs> it is big. Um, I, th I think that's the idea, old boy. This is where it starts to get hard, by the way, the, the big loaf of bread. So don't go anywhere. We're, uh, we're not done yet by... Uh, it really is like a full loaf. Uh, by some distance, as you can probably tell by my face. There's more hot sauce on the bottom of the bun. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I thought we were past that particular pitfall. Not so. Again though, luckily they only put a little bit on there. Not enough to entirely derail the train. That that bread looks pretty tough. Like It, it looks like he's kind of peeling it away as he's... That, that makes it a lot harder too. Oh, this bread is chewy. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah! You do have to admire the confidence, even if they are just being polite. And to be fair, it doesn't look like I've got much left, but this bread is slow work, man. This was a lot of effort. I'm very much looking forward to the mac and cheese about now. I'm so sorry. Um, could I get a diet coke, please? Oh, I don't, um, I don't, maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> Does she even work there? Maybe not allowed additional drinks. That would be a problem. Alright, man, turn it up. I'm almost there, almost. Good luck, good luck. No, you can't leave, dude. How do you just leave? You at least gotta sit there and watch him finish and celebrate with him, right? Thank you, thanks. They can make crash barriers out of this bread. Ugh. He said they could make crash barriers out of this bread. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, we gotta get we gotta get some better bread here. Oh, thank god. Oh I thought god, you're almost done though. Almost. This isn't the same girl. It's not the same girl, right? I thought she was gonna say you're not allowed like more drink. I was thinking, oh my god, this is gonna be hard. No, I did double check. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Just pull that over there. That's not the girl he asked for a Coke. I know it's. Come on! <laughs> Pep talk. I was worried there for a second, you know, that they, uh, they limited the drinks. Would have been here all day if that were the case. For He's only 17 minutes in. Like. He could wait around for 30 minutes and then finish the rest. Certainly not, though. I think I've figured out why they have that no dunking rule. Because the bread is the hardest bit. Yeah, sneaky. I like that, though, and it's not necessarily just the amount of food or the time that makes it hard. Not surprising, though, that they've had, uh, what do you say, 76 losers? The mac and cheese is nice and soft, thankfully. Ooh. Heal me, too. Yeah, all right, all right, steady on. You get a little bit excited there. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, as always, I'll see you in about a week for the next episode. That was much more difficult than I thought it was going to be. Imagine just traveling around the world eating the best food around. Like, what an epic job. Ugh. Oh, you dropped a piece right here. <laughs> I reckon that's probably done. 
All right, this is Baby's food, and that was the Fat Boy Challenge. 22 and a half minutes. Is that good? Good. Yeah? Five minutes, I think we're good. There was the other girl. See? Good. Yeah? Oh, she does work there. Good news, she does work there. Five minutes, I think we're clear though. While I'm doing that, do you guys have a dessert menu? <laughs> Look at this guy's face. This lady too. Oh, how funny. I gotta go back. I think we're clear though. While I'm doing that, do you guys have a dessert menu? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, do you agree with that? Hot fudge brownie? Hot fudge brownie? I think that's a cobbler, but that's my opinion. Oh, that does sound I'm good. Gonna to... I'm going to go with apple cobbler. Oh. Don't be offended. <laughs> Don't be offended. Ooh, shirt and come in. All I got is kid size, but that's perfect. <laughs> All I got is a kid size. What does that even mean? Did you see that? That, that sandwich was bigger than a kid. <laughs> a tiny man. That's cool. Thank you very much, man. Did you finish it? I did finish it, yeah. Thank you. Dang, he got excited about winning a shirt, and then it was like a kid's shirt he couldn't even wear. Oh God, God. This this business better ship this dude a regular size shirt. Thank you. Everyone's so friendly out here. Americans seem to respect almost anything, apart from free healthcare. Nothing in the world is free, brother. Nothing in the world is free. <laughs> it's gonna make people mad. <laughs> oh, is this the cobbler? Oh, thank you very much. Appreciate it. Cheers. Cobbler. The only thing that's free is your sandwich, but you did earn it. Of course, being American terminology for... What if they made him pay for the drink and the cobbler? <laughs> Looks young, though. Yeah. Ooh, that is pretty good. Oh, can't forget my special cap. Oh, they gave him a hat too? Oh, a hat is worth it. Oh, I like that one. Oh, right, I'm like... Oh. Let's get it! <laughs> that was perfect, man. <laughs> Holy shit, I want all your stuff, man. Cheers, man, thank you. Man, that was a... That was a workout. Enjoy it, son. <laughs> All right, guys, that was a massive sandwich. It actually made me really hungry. Even the apple cobbler looked delicious. This is a very funny video. I enjoy watching this guy. Um, he's kind of straight to the point, very short and psh, 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 videos, and uh, I can get behind that. Another thing, sorry about the outro yesterday. We didn't realize when I exported that it didn't get the full thing. Apologize. I know you guys were just giving me a hard time messing around, but... Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, maybe check out this video where I reacted to another food challenge and come back tomorrow to watch something else. See you then.